ค่ะต่อไปเป็นมาดามเตียวลีงอกรรมการบริหารค่ะค่ะคุณโกหินเพียวผู้อำนวยการฝ่ายการตลาดค่ะค่ะและคุณกัญญิกาคติวิชาผู้จัดการฝ่ายบัญชีและการเงินลำดับต่อไปขอเชิญคุณยัสซูชวนค่ะสวัสดีครับ everybody and uh, welcome to the opportunity day Uh, today I'll talk on the following subjects briefly. Uh, basically, the Thailand car industry is growing very strongly, as all of you know, and uh, the uh, next growth factor is the uh, eco car in Thailand. The original forecast for 2010: 1.4 million. Now the new forecast is 1.6 million cars. Next year they are saying it's increased 10-15 percent, but uh, we are still waiting for the confirmation. Car production trend again uh, very strong. I think the one point I want you to observe is this 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 no, this this strong growth here. Normally in December, motor show. The car sale is uh, very strong. So this is a December motor show. Last year, motor show in December here, the uh, the sale continued to come down. So which means this year is really, uh, you know, the impact is extremely strong. Car production trend. This is the production trend. One ton pick up. 389,000 units, first half of 2009, uh, 2010, 768,000 units. The increase is 97.60% Q on Q. The car production volume is 7.2% higher than for the first half of the year 2008. We are comparing 2008 not 2009, because 2009 was a very bad year. The level in second quarter is slightly higher than first quarter, 2010. Domestic car sales trend. Again, very strong. Domestic car sales trend quarter on quarter. First half 29, first half 2010. For passenger cars, 43%. For one ton, one ton pickup, 51% this year. Uh, for this year, 45, 49. Pickup drop a little bit. Passenger car expand a little bit. But the growth, tremendous growth, 54.13%. Domestic sales volume for the first half of 2010 has improved from the year 2008 by 11.37%. 2007, 2008 one was the one of the best years in Thailand, and 2010 will be the record for Thailand. Total uh, vehicle market, Toyota is still the best seller for the uh, January to June. Passenger car is number one. This is the uh, pickup and car sales for first six months in Thailand, 356,000. Top 10 vehicle sales is Toyota, Isuzu, Honda, Nissan, Mazda, Mitsubishi, Chevrolet, Hino, Ford, and Proton. I think Mazda is very strong. It's also because of the uh, Mazda 2. We supply a lot of parts to Mazda 2 and the B car. The B car is just being launched. Big up sales, number one, Toyota, Isuzu, Nissan, Mitsubishi, Chevrolet, Ford, and Mazda. I think Nissan is also uh, getting strong and Mitsubishi also getting strong. I don't know whether you're aware, Mitsubishi is building a new assembly plant eh, in Thailand. They just announced. 
Top 10 car vehicle sales, Toyota, Honda, Mazda, Nissan, Chevrolet, Mitsubishi, Proton, Benz, BMW, Suzuki. I think uh, in the next few months probably you see Ford because the Fiesta is launched in September. So I think by early next year Ford will become also in the passenger car because the Fiesta is a very nice car. Market update, Ford Motor Company plans to invest $450 million to construct a new passenger vehicle plant in Thailand. The plant will be located in Hemraj Eastern Seaboard Industrial Estate in Rayong with a capacity of 200,000 units. First model to be launched is Ford Focus, followed by two other models. Mazda continue to ride high from the momentum generated by the popularity of Mazda 2, which enabled the brand to post sales of 16,000. 895 units in the first six months for 240% growth, the highest in the market. Positive outlook on Thailand automotive industry sales at the end of June showed a growth of 62.6% over the same period last year. Mitsubishi announced to build a new plant in Liam Chabang for 15 billion baht to produce the new eco car. This plant is very big. It is even bigger than a Ford plant. Surprising. It's double the size of the Suzuki plant. GM announced new expansion plan and new engine plant. Toyota invests 4 million baht to expand plant in Chacheng Sao. Increased capacity from 120,000 to 200,000 units per year. Plan to produce primers hybrid in Thailand to export to overseas. Suzuki purchased 450 rye of land for construction of the new plant for production of eco car. Eco car and G car, I think, uh, just to uh, let you see. These cars are very modern and very beautiful. Nissan already launched their Eco car. And uh, next year, Nissan will also launch another model of small car. Honda already placed their orders for the Eco car in Thailand. It will be launched next year. Suzuki is now negotiating on price. Toyota is now negotiating on price on the EFC. They call it economic family car. Tata has given up the Coca but plan to have Nano. So you have Nissan, Honda, Suzuki, Toyota, Tata, which is uh, thinking of the Nano, which is a small, very cheap car. Financial summary. This is the comparison comparison, second quarter 2008, second quarter 2009, first quarter uh, 2010, second quarter 2010. Uh, basically, uh, the significant uh, improvement you can see is uh, second quarter, we have 1.5 billion for uh, second quarter 20, uh, 2010 is 2.9 billion. Even compared to last quarter, this is uh, first quarter, second quarter, we have a significant increase of uh, sale. I think uh, the main reason is because of the uh, new models and the growth of the market, basically. And uh, as a result, if you compare to last quarter of last year, and this quarter is very difficult to compare because the last quarter we lost money. So I think the figures are all really, uh, you know, difficult to, you know, to really uh, follow because it's such a big difference. Eh? So I think, uh, you know, I don't know how to explain this thousands of percent. No? Yeah. I think also uh, all the other data here, if you see the uh, debt equity ratio, I think uh, is. It increased, increased slightly from 2Q0 and 9 because I think uh, we pay up our machines, uh, you know, this year. A lot of machines we delay last year, we start paying up this year. So, increase our debt marginally. Next. I think this is uh, probably an easier way to compare. First half, first half, and then... Uh, uh, first half uh, 2010. So it, it is a half year, half year results. You can see that this is 08 first half, 
09, first half, uh, 10. First half, you can see the uh, last year was really a terrible year. And as a result, you can see that we have a loss. We have a 5.4% profit, 08. We have a 